And along with live music, unconventional performances, there are some special guests we're meeting over at the True Line groundbreaking in the west end of downtown Greenville. Access Carolina's on location. She just talked with Marcus King and now another big star up next, Ava. Yeah, a name you're very familiar with, Mr. Josh Turner. Thanks for joining us today on the show. Good to be here. Absolutely, the iconic voice. Good to be here. Wow, that just took me back to so many amazing songs that have really rivaled country music's best. Tell you, got, you got a new single coming out tomorrow, right? Tell me about that. I do. It's called Heating Things Up, and uh, that's exactly what we're going to be doing here mm -hmm. in the next few weeks uh, with this song and the upcoming album. And I'm I'm very excited to to have some new actual you know original country music coming out at the, for the last several years. I've done a lot of my passion projects, which was was a lot of fun, and mm -hmm. the fans have appreciated it. But uh, like I say, it's, it's, it was time to get back in the studio and, yeah. and do some new stuff. So. Well, you got to have those passion projects, right? It keeps you having fun at the same time. And um, this weekend, you're going to be over at the Anderson Soiree. Tell me a little bit more about what uh, you're excited for to head over there. Yeah, well, obviously, today is a big day. And uh, I'll be in Anderson tomorrow and then North Myrtle Beach on Saturday. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm kind of doing my little rounds here in South Carolina Absolutely. for this weekend, so which is always good for me because uh, this, is, this is my home state and I always love being here. Yeah, well, we're happy that we are a stop in your SC tour, so yep. obviously you're a huge name here in South Carolina and the country. Michael Grozier getting you to come out here. What does this mean as you've just seen so many people excited for a venue like this in our, in our city? I, I think it's what it needs. Um, you know, the, the South Carolina story told through uh, the medium of music I, I think is uh, extremely important. Um, and to have you know something tangible like this to where you can come and see uh, you know the people that have kind of put South Carolina on the map is, is a good thing to have so and a lot of those people are going to be at the Hall of Fame tonight who are you inspired by that's going to be there tonight and you're excited to meet well it's funny because uh, I, I guess Bill Anderson is actually receiving the first ever lifetime achievement award uh, here tonight um, and he was actually the one who actually introduced me for the my Opry debut, Grand Ole Opry debut, um, and uh, so that, that, that's going to be pretty cool for me. Unbelievable. Well, we are very, very excited for you and the rest of the album that's um, coming out. What, what inspired that? You know, anything tough, positive, negatives? What went into that one? All of the above. Okay. <laughs> it's a mixed bag. Um, when people hear this record, they're going to hear a lot of variety. Um, some songs I wrote, some songs I didn't. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of different stories on, on this on this record. Sure, and sure. Um, You know, so it, it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Very intriguing for me to listen to, so I know it's going to be fun for the fans. Yeah. Well, I'm excited to see kind of that cheeky Josh first personality come on out in that album and you know country music has changed a lot we got a lot of newcomers trying to change the game a lot of newcomers trying to keep it the way it was where do you kind of fall on the line of country music where it's at now well my heart's always been in traditional country music but at the same time I get bored very easily so right. I'm always trying to you know just take traditional country music to a place that it's never been and so um, you know there's things that have to stay the same but there's also ways that you can kind of push the envelope and yeah. kind of make things sound new and fresh and so that's always kind of been my my you know, goal with mm -hmm. every record, and, mm -hmm. and so I think we accomplished that this time. Wow. Well, Josh Turner is just like everybody else, guys. He's at ADHD just like the rest of us. <laughs> yeah. I definitely feel that. Well, um, I think the best kind of country music comes out of South Carolina. What other, you know, artists are you proud of? You know, maybe a shout out for younger artists coming up. Anyone that's caught your eye recently? Uh, recently, I mean, obviously, Lainey Wilson is, you know, just uh, hotter than a rocket right now. You know, she uh, she actually was uh, playing shows with me in England back in 2019 uh, before she even had a hit. And so that was it was kind of cool to see her go from there to where she's at now. Um, you know, so, yeah, there, I mean, there's a lot of, you know, and um, I just inducted Scotty McCreary into the Grand Ole Opry this yeah. past Saturday. Um, and so it, it, I was, that was a very proud moment for everybody involved. And, and so, yeah, there's there's a lot of a lot of good artists out there. Country music's in, in good hands. Definitely. I think so. And I'd love to see you on different platforms in the future. A game show host, perhaps. Would you ever, would you ever go on like The Voice or American Idol, something like that? I don't know. We'll have to uh, enter into the negotiation process uh, okay. and see what happens. Well, I'll put in a few good words <laughs> for you, Josh. Well, thank you so much. And I know you've got a lot of things to do today. You know, what do you do when you're here in South Carolina? you got a few hours off. Uh, usually spend time with family and friends because this is where all my family and friends come to see me play, um, you know, because it's close and easy for them. But, yeah. uh, but other than that, you know, hunting and fishing, obviously, and just, uh, just being a normal South Carolina boy. So. Tell them. Awesome. <laughs> well, I'm sure there is a little extra love inside your heart when you're playing in front of your friends and family, but you put on a good show, as I know, every single time. So thank you so much, Josh. Oh, thank Appreciate you. Appreciate you. All righty. <laughs> Wrapping up our coverage here, but there is still more fun to come here in the West End at True Lines Groundbreaking.
This, it says a lot about Drew, right? You're just there hanging out with Josh Turner, just a regular what? day downtown. Ava, that's, that's amazing.